Hey YouTubers, uh, this is the Fishing Educator coming to you live from outside. That's right, it's about to rain. Uh, I've been working in my garage a little bit today. Wanted to show you real quickly, for those of you out there that have a uh, trolling motor, uh, particularly a 12 volt trolling motor, and you're wanting to connect two batteries together to extend the life of your trolling motor when you're out fishing. So one battery might last three hours, adding a second battery can last six hours. I actually use both of these batteries. Uh, I get my batteries from uh, Walmart is where I recommend it, cheap and expensive. Remember, cheap and expensive is what, I, what I'm about. Um, but if you want to connect these together to, to create uh, up to six hours in, in the case of my trolling motor, um, you want to make sure that you have a good wire uh, with a good thick gauge, as I do here. So I've got a couple of wires, and really what you want to do is you want to take the negative uh, from one battery and connect it to the negative of the other battery. When you're connecting these together in your boat, that's what you want to do. You want to start by connecting your two negatives together. Once you have done that, you're then going to want to take and connect your two positive terminals together. Positive terminal, positive terminal. You get those two connected. And I'm not going to put all these nuts on here right now, but you would want to put those on there good and tight. So you're connecting these two batteries together. What you want to do from here, go ahead and put this one on, is you would want to take your trolling motor, and let's say your trolling motor, your negative charge, your trolling motor negative um, terminal end, you would stick on one of the batteries. You then want to take your positive, usually that's a red one, and you'll put it on the opposite battery. So don't attach them to the same battery but one terminal to one battery, one terminal to the other. You just need to choose negative for one, positive for the other. So it could be this negative one and this positive one. Once you have those connected, I would put these together under your boat so they're squished together and you should be good. Uh, hey, thanks for watching and if you want, want to watch more videos like this, be sure to click that like button and subscribe uh, and you'll see more videos on how to fish the easy way for guys on the weekends that just want to get out and have a good time and fish. Check out my other videos. Again, be sure to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.